I'm surprised Isaac hasn't cooked that thing for supper. Almost done, Isaac. No need for any more loadouts now. I know you're not expecting any action down there, but I just gotta show you this cool thing I did with the Drac laser. It's got a totally new alt fire. Okay, go ahead. Take your pick. What are the specs on the Widowmaker? A beautiful precision instrument with a variable zoom. It's got a computerized targeting system that compensates for wind and other variables to put a 50 caliber slug within an inch of where you aim it from two clicks away. Altfire toggles you in and out of zoom mode, and you can use the wheel control to zoom in further. Ammo is generally hard to come by, so don't waste it. Anything else? See you later. John, you there? <laughs> Nabon brought you down, but it wasn't pretty. I'm <laughs> fine. What's going on? The Scar have landed in force. They've taken over the base and they control <laughs> the planetary cannon. I tried to raise General <laughs> Drexler, but none of his people even seem to be here. This must have been some kind of trap. The only friendly nearby is Commander Hawkins. He made it off planet and he's up here in his flagship, the Dorian Gray. Can you get me out of here? I can't come get you while the cannon is active. You have to disable it. Ow. The controls are in the tower. You know the way. I'm on it.
Bring the Atlantis down and pick up a lot of you. On my way. See you soon, McMillan. Walk in the park, sir. Unless I take the Scar Free For All Express. I prefer a ride I can walk away from. Huh? Christ. I'll send out a man to fix the generator. Can you find a good vantage point to give him cover? That's why God invented the sniper rifle. Eye in the sky has got you covered. Got a scar here! Thought that scar had me! Looking good so far. I'm gonna blow the fence. You got as much time as I got ammo. Not a lot. Got you covered. Almost done.
Ilzi's on top. We need to work our way up there. Follow me. Watch for Scar. In position, Ida. Anytime you're ready. On my way. Heads up! More scar! Let's move! Oh, 
is failing. No, it's not. Hit the reserves. Fly, you son of a bitch. The Atlantis is gone, John. Shot down. We did a search and rescue, but... Nothing. I'm sorry. After we picked you up, we recovered the artifacts from the wreckage and brought them to the Dorian Gray. Once we had them all, we were able to decipher the glyphs. They tell of an ancient race, the Tosk. Noble warriors who served their masters in battle. When there were no more masters to serve, their scientists hid their DNA within that of another race and forged these artifacts against the day they might once again be needed. The race that contains their DNA is still with us today. The Kai. Isn't that the cook? The warrior Kai! You're right. I don't get it. Over time, the artifacts became scattered across the planets. If we are the ones to reunite them, the Tosk will serve us with weapons of awesome power. I will be their new master, and I will wield these weapons on behalf of the Earth in our battle with the Scar. It is possible that the glyphs lie, or that we have read them incorrectly, but I am willing to take that chance with certain precautions. Only one Kai, in a containment chamber, with you and those men standing by in case something goes wrong. Stand by. I am putting the final artifact in place.
I'm recording this while you're up in the tower. Commander Hawkins just ordered me to dock with the Dorian Gray and turn over the artifacts. Suddenly it all clicked into place. General Drexler has had nothing to do with any of this. It's all been Hawkins. How could I not have seen it? Hawkins! But I'm not giving Hawkins the artifacts, John. He wants to use them for himself, but we're not going to let him. The Bon and Isaac are with me. We're going to hold him off as long as we can. If he shoots us down, he'll make it look like the scar, but you'll know the truth. You and Bon and Isaac want to talk with you, too. Stevens, take a detail and clear a path to the escape pods. Don't tell anyone or you'll start a panic. I'll follow in a minute. Bastard! with me to the escape pod, John. All I have to do is push this button and the ship will plunge into the sun. It's the only way to kill these Tosk. But you and I will live to fight another day. We'll learn to control the Tosk. And then we'll rule to- You killed my crew! No, I- I trusted you. John, she wouldn't give me the artifacts. If the Scar got them, it was my duty. I believe in duty too, Hawkins. And now I know what mine is. Area. No! 
Zero Star FG 708. Course correction impossible. All personnel abandon ship. Abandon ship! Abandon ship! But you'll know the truth. Even Bon and Isaac want to talk with you too. Greetings, Marshal. I am saluting you yet again. You are many good men. Despite who I am, you shared with me the danger and fatigue of a meaningful task. You have given me my life. So, if I die, it is only right that I have given you mine. I'm scared, but I'm not scared. I'm ready for this. You had faith in me, John, and I'm grateful. If you make it and I don't, go to the old club back in Quantico, buy a round for the house, and uh, have one last drink for me. This is no suicide mission, John, but I won't abandon you. We're gonna fight like hell and try to hold on till we can pick you up. Then we'll all boost out of here together and figure out what to do next. If we don't make it, well, at least you might get to the artifacts before Hawkins. You were right about Tycho, John. Sometimes the few have to give their lives for the many. You were right about something else, too. You said I had to choose who to trust. I choose you. Goodbye. <laughs>